ゃねって,てなおーしゃ<笑>させてんじゃねえ He ate that front of the shed. He ate those for breakfast, son. Oh, my God, got issues. Well, well, well. It's a beautiful day today. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Sakaji the Prodigy, aka Sakage. Whatever you want to come in, we're back with another anime reaction. This time we're gonna be reacting to Windbreaker episode 9. And we left off where Choji and Umami were ready to throw it down. Sakura already fought Togame. Togame let Sakura win for whatever reasons he had. I personally think he just learned something through that fight. More so that Sakura taught him what he should have done before Choji became rogue and who he is right now. Meaning he probably should have fought Choji and stood down on 10 toes of what he believed in to ultimately save his best friend. Obviously Sakura was pissed about how Choji was, was being towards Togame. I mean roundhouse kicking your best friend or or your second in command is actually absurd like that's actually that's insane but obviously big boy gojo mamiya aka hajime saturo came in between everything to save sakura from an ass whooping that he probably was gonna receive from choji had he had not stepped in so i'm excited we get to see how strong umami and choji really are and basically two top dogs from their actual groups going at it i'm excited for this episode also for those of you who are new to the channel basically i upload new anime reaction every single week to the new and current anime i'm watching on top of that i make amvs as well they both go neck and neck and i can't make a new anime or a new video without watching a new anime but without taking up any more of your time let's get right into the reaction bro this fight is gonna be so insane bro Hey, Choji's standing on business, though. I'll give him that. Yeah, he's insane, bro. I'm not even gonna lie. Sakura, you would've got <laughs> destroyed. Oh, no. Oh. Umami is just too strong, bro. Yeah, my knuckles. No strength. Huh? This is why weight classes are a thing. なにも背負ってねえからだ。軽いだかなんだか知らないけどさ。倒れるまでやれば同じでしょ。浴びせてあげるよ。ね、ホミスタミナイズクレイジーだ。I Oh shit! <laughs> Is he done? Bro, just well, duh. Look at look how much bigger he is. いや、みたいな強いやつとな喧嘩。せ、ヒスペースだぞ。お前のことを何も分かっていない。だから満たされないし、たらればもう言いたくなる。だがそれ以上に。そんな奴が鉄片になっちまったチームに同情する。ストック
And Togame as being the real friend, like still looking out for him, still trying to be there for him, still trying to win him back. I don't know. We'll see. Let's just, let's just, we'll see. Sekai ga hairo ni natta no itsu kara dakke. I still want to see like a good fight between them because we're not getting that. We got a glimpse of it at the end of last episode. Kara kara de. Nani ga tarinai no? Nande tarinai no? Wakaranai. Tomo muri nanda. Hey yo, man's tweaking. Why is bro spazzing out like that? Oh. Alright, cool. Now we're getting the oh. Hey yo, Umamiya, do something, bro. What are you doing? Anybody else would be dead by now. My father Sugishida. Me and Sakura thought the exact same way right here. Suma, you are not going to be able to get out of here. But if you are not going to be able to get out of here, you are not going to be able to get out of here. Oh wait, yo, what the? Wait, whoa, whoa, chill out, bro. You're tripping out. Homie really bit him. That's a little sus, but what the heck, bro? What's wrong with you, bro? He could, he could have killed you right there, bro. Like straight up. This guy's not right in the head. What is that haircut? Wait, yo, my boy looks so different. They're younger. Yeah. That's what Togemi was trying to like show Choji, but he couldn't do it because he's gonna pat his head. Pause. Tomiyama. Like headbutt him. <laughs> All right, cool. He's not getting off the hook that easily. He knocked him out. I wanted more. I'm not gonna lie, though. I wanted more. Tomiyama. Neko ga nadete hoshisou datta kara. Kinchou kan ne na. Kore kara kenka shi ni iku ってのによ. Doko to kenka suren dakke. <laughs> Yo, Bobby, this cat's for you, my boy. <laughs> I know you love cats. Bro, you abandoned everybody. You kicked them out. He's picking up the pieces and putting them back together. Yo, this is a Kingdom Hearts intro oh. right here, bro. Yumeka. <laughs> See his eyes. If his eyes are back to normal, then he remembers. So I understood something. If everyone is laughing and enjoying it, I'm also enjoying it. I made Choji alone. I don't know what he's suffering from. But Choji needs to apologize too, bro. Everyone is laughing. Choji is the one who is being betrayed. W friend. Choji is the one who is being betrayed. ジョージがみんなに愛されて俺はそれを担いでる俺は泣いてかって女に強くても命の恩人でも目をそらしたり自分を曲げたりしてね踊りを貫くために二日らなきゃいけなかったご体を一緒に探さないでごめん一人にし
みんなでバカ笑いしてたあの頃楽しかったんだ俺はとっくに自由だったんだでもそれに気づけなかった自分で壊したんだカメちゃんがいなかったら今頃何にもなくなってたね違う。ずっと前からそんな顔してたんだねごめんカメちゃん痛かったよね辛かったよね Bro, Umemiya is him, bro He literally knocks some sense into him You know, I bet you gotta whoop someone's ass for, for them to finally be like, you know what? ありがとう、カメちゃん You right, bro I think I could cheer the fight Round 3, 2 俺は梅ちゃんに負けただからシシトーレンを抜けるみんなをよろしくお願いします He's not gonna accept it. He's gonna be like, no, you're you are the leader. えやだよ<笑>お前が勝手にかけた勝負にしてただけで<笑>上だ下だとかめんどくさいで,でも<笑><笑>今日から俺たち友達ってことで今日の喧嘩はあれだ親睦会みたいなみんなも集まってくれてありがとうな He's like, hey, let's just hang out Meaning, let's fight, bro <laughs> This guy is a b e a bro This guy is something else やっぱり梅ちゃんは面白いね Goofy as hell じゃあ今日は終わり But when it's time to get serious These are the last guys you want to fight I love the way how Umumiya handles everything and just how much of a leader he truly is. Did I expect a little more in this episode? Yes, I, I really wanted the fight to be a lot more better. I thought it could have been a lot more better just because, you know, they're the best of the best. I think Umumiya didn't really go all out. I think that's what it was. I think Choji really went all out. Umumiya style. He went about it differently. And he saw like a broken leader or a lost leader. And legit knocked some sense into him, which is the funny part. And ultimately got the whole Lionsgate group back together. It's still a great episode, though, nonetheless. I loved every single bit of it. We got to see more about Choji and his little despair that he was going through. We gotta see how Togame was in the back end picking up all the pieces for him just to keep the group intact. It was really cool. I just was hoping for the fight to just be a little more better. But it is what it is. I can't, you know. At the end of the day, we did get a Choji versus Umamiya fight. I think it probably would have been cooler if they put the last bit of the last episode with them fighting into this episode. So it would have felt longer. But I get it, you know, for episode purposes and the length. It all makes sense. Nonetheless, great episode. And I, I wonder what's, uh, I wonder what's next from here on. We need to see Kotaha back again because every time she's around, it's hilarious and Sakura is the top tier s u n d e r e But if you haven't already, definitely hit that like button. Don't forget to leave a comment down below too. Let me know what you guys are thinking. Hit that subscribe button, hit that bell notification so you don't miss a single upload. On top of that, don't forget to head on over to my Patreon as well. All the full uncurved versions of the anime reactions are uploaded there first. And if you haven't already, Definitely check out my most recent AMV. All the links to everything will be in the description down below. And as always, I'm gonna leave a snippet on the screen. Honestly, the biggest takeaway from this episode though was it takes a lot to be a true leader, you know? And above all, being a great friend. When you're pursuing a goal or a dream or whatever it is, when you're trying to move to the ranks to the tops and just keep climbing that ladder, you don't want to forget anybody that was with you from the beginning. You can't forget those people who were supporting you. You can't forget those people who were pushing you. You can't forget those people that were there with you during those tough times. Because when you do make it, you feel empty inside. Kind of like Choji was. He was on his way trying to make it to the top, but he was pushing everybody away. So in the end, he had nobody to turn to when, you know, he looked back. He's like, where's, where's everybody that I thought was with me without even realizing he was pushing everybody away? Lucky for him, though, he had a great friend like Togame who was being the anchor, the backbone of the group, and a true friend, picking up all the pieces and holding it all intact. So the day that Choji did come to his senses, which it finally came after I don't know how long it was exactly, it happened. So never forget those who were there with you from the beginning, you know? I get it, we all go through phases, but that's why it's important to have those people or person in your life that's there for you. I'll leave you with that. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Have a blessed day. God bless you guys. I love every single one of you. Thank you for watching until the very end. Don't forget to share some laughs. Don't forget to make someone smile. Don't forget to spread some love. You know, life is too short at the end of the day. Can't thank you guys enough. And as always, I will see you guys on the next episode. Later.